Bear sighting in mid-Michigan, the latest a bear captured on a trail cam in Clio. This after a bear was spotted in Saginaw County's Thomas Township last week. TV 5's Lenita Brooks spoke with the Department of Natural Resources and she joins us in the studio with what you should do if you see a bear in or around your property. Lenita. Yeah, well, as I found out, bear sightings around this time of year are actually pretty common, but there are still some precautions you can take. These are young male black bears that are looking for a new home range. So basically they're looking for their own space to live. Rachel Lincoln, Wildlife Outreach Coordinator for the DNR, speaking on what you should do if you see a bear. This after two local bear sightings in the past week. Once what happens is we just have too much uh, infrastructure here. There's a lot of roadways, there's a lot of buildings, and there's not a lot of female black bears here. So after a few weeks of, you know, walking around the area looking for food sources, they usually turn around and head back up north. A Thomas Township resident reported seeing a bear near Gratia Road in Georgian Terrace last Thursday. This morning, about 30 miles south, a woman reported seeing another one in Vienna Township along Linden Road about a mile west of I-75 near the Cloud Country Club. Lincoln says it's more common than you think to see them around this time of year. But if you see one in your backyard, there are a few things you should do. Michigan black bears are pretty docile. They're pretty elusive, they're shy animals, they really are not aggressive. And so if you do happen to come across one, the best thing you can do is just remain calm. Uh, you wanna stand your ground, do not run or play dead. Um, but if the animal appears to be distracted and you can take a couple of slow steps backwards to head back inside your house or to get to your vehicle, you can do that. Uh, you just wanna make a lot of loud noises and make sure the animal knows you're there. And other tips include taking in your bird feeders around this time of year, also making sure you don't leave any trash out or pet foods outside in your backyards. Any food items is what actually attracts them, so making sure you keep those clear it will keep you safe.